Hi friends, today I discuss charge particles in matter. Charge particles in matter. In previous chapters, we discussed that atoms and molecules, atoms and molecules are the fundamental building blocks of matter. are the fundamentals fundamental building blocks of matter fundamental building blocks of matter or the smallest unit of a matter then after describing about atom and molecules first what is atom composed of now atom is divisible atom is divisible and consist of charged particles consist of charged particles consist of charged particles now we can say atom was composed of atom was composed of composed of protons and electrons protons and electrons the protons are represented by denoted by small p and electrons are denoted by small e charge on both are same charge on both are same on proton charge plus 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb it's a positive charge and the same charge on electron q equal to minus 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb charge on both proton and electrons are same proton or electrons are same and protons are present in interior of the atoms so protons were protons were interior interior of the atom so protons were interior of the atom now the big big question is that how is the structure of atom how is the structure of atom so discuss in next page now discuss structure of atom according to dalton atomic theory which suggests that the atom was individual individual and indestructible but the discovery of two fundamental particles like electrons and proton inside the atom led to the failure of this aspect of dalton atomic theory now the first scientist which is J. J. Thomson which is J. J. Thomson was the first one to propose a model or the first one to propose a model for for the structure of an atom structure of an atom and the Thomson model structure is called Thomson's model of an 
atom. Thomson's model of an atom. Now, now Thomson proposed the model of an atom to be similar that Christmas Christmas pudding Christmas pudding or watermelon or watermelon According to Thomson the structure of atom like as Christmas pudding or watermelon or watermelon According to Thomson the electrons in a sphere of positive charge over like currents currents means dry fruits like edge currents or we can say electron like edge currents means dry fruit means dry fruit in a spherical in a spherical christmas pudding or he can say or he say or th according to thomson this structure of atoms looks like as watermelon where the positive charge in the atom is spread all over like so this red part of is positive charge the red part is positive charge in atom and edible part the seeds are called electron or negative charge so the positive charge is spread all over the atom and edible part and red edible part of the watermelon while the electrons stood in the positive charge sphere like the seeds in the watermelon so thomson proposed that an atom consist of a positively charged sphere positively charged sphere and the electrons and the electrons are embedded in it embedded in it and the second thing the negative and positive charge the negative and positive charge are equal in magnitude are equal in magnitude so the atom so the atom age atom as a whole is electrically neutral electrically electrically neutral electrically neutral so so now this is a this is the thomson model of atom so the structure of atom according to thomson so i hope you understand what is the thomson model of an atom so please download the scholar learning app and if you already download this then enjoy learning thanks to watching this video